question is, can I pray during my worship set? And that would depend on a couple things. It depends on the way you do church. Uh, it depends a little bit on your, your tradition or uh, the, the way your worship time is formatted. It also depends on how your leadership feels about you praying during a worship set. Um, on one hand, our job is to get up there, sing the songs, encourage people, but keeping it short and sweet, short's always better. Uh, uh, on the other hand, you know, I think it's something that it's the glue, you know, praying between songs or even in the midst of the song. To me, it, it, it kind of, it's like uh, in our bodies, you know, we have the tendons and the, the sinewy, all, the, all that stuff that kind of keeps the bones and everything together, you know, like the songs are like the bones, but then we've got this stuff that kind of holds it all together. And just that, having that prayerful attitude, even if you're not praying long prayers, um, you know, you could start off with prayers from the Psalms. Take some of David's prayers, little short and sweet things. You know, if I was going to do, you know, I know in one of the Psalms it says, Oh God, you are my God, and earnestly will I seek thee. Oh God, you are my God. You know, just maybe one or two lines like that. Just a brief, um, a brief line or two from Scripture to me really kind of creates a, a, a context for the song you're about to sing or the song you just came out of, perhaps. Um, I always like to, you've heard me say on maybe some of my other videos that during the week I like to go into my church and just kind of minister to the Lord and spend some time just singing out, reading scripture with, the, with my guitar in my hand and just trying to get this vertical thing going for real. Just trying to be, you know, not as a technique, but I want it to be an honest just time of learning to just sing and pray and talk to the Lord and listen to the Lord. And then, you know, Sunday morning should basically be taking that time and now you're on a stage in front of people and it, at the very least you're taking that posture or that attitude and you may not talk or say as much as you did when you were by yourself, but now at least there's that posture, that attitude of, um, you know, good morning folks and you know, Bible says blah, 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 blah. And let's just pray before we get started. Jesus, we just come to you. We ask that you just come and inhabit our praises this morning as we lift your name. Lord, I lift your name on high, you know, and then you go into your song. So I would say if presently, if you're not praying, um, you know, if, if your leadership also check with them, you know, again, but just respect that they're not wanting you to preach a sermon, you know, if they, otherwise you'd be the senior pastor or the teaching pastor. They want you to lead worship. They want you to encourage worship. So just be, be good at that. But to me, I would just take some baby steps and occasionally in between a song, maybe just one or two lines just to set up the next tune and then move right into the next song. So take some baby steps and kind of see how that feels. See if your leadership, if they give you some feedback, oh, that was really nice. That was really good. In fact, Many times in the early years of leading worship, you know, at the end of service, um, I wouldn't even think about necessarily what I was going to be praying, but people would come up at the end of service sometimes and say, oh, you know, boy, this morning worship really, you know, touched me this morning. And, uh, you know, especially when you just pray that little prayer, you know, towards the end there, that, re you know, that's exactly what I wanted to say to the Lord. And I, I couldn't even remember what I said, but just, you know, when you get that kind of feedback, then just kind of just with the, with the right spirit, just know that that can be a very powerful time to pray during your worship set, but kind of grow into it and don't overdo it right at the top.